right. What's up, my quesadillas? And get your kiss on. Every kiss begins with a. Today is a sit down talk video. Haven't done one of these in a while. I gotta look this script up on Google Docs. Hold up. So a lot of males are always asking me, Kate, hey, how do you get so many big Seriously though, I actually do get a lot of messages. Girls tell me about their love life, like what should they do? Or guys tell me about how to get this specific girl they like. Maybe I'm like the love guru, I don't know. But in this video, I'm gonna tell you all why I think women like me and maybe my fellas can follow if you want, I don't know. So I'm not the most attractive person in the world. I'm second next to Hansel from Zoolander. I'm also not the most muscular, but there are things Things that I do that I think make women like me and maybe you guys can do it too so let's go over the obvious things I'm Japanese American so I appeal to twice as many people trust me it's science all right I also have a really crispy jawline which girls like I got nice collarbones which I don't show a lot which is good because it adds a surprise factor if a girl is not really interested in me I just gotta flash my collarbone Oh, it doesn't look very crispy right now. Um, I don't know, living in Japan got me fat. But the big reason why girls like me is because I dance. Dancing is very attractive because it shows that you can get groovy if you know what I mean. And for me especially, I'm very passionate in dance and being passionate in something in general is pretty attractive. I'm not talking about being passionate for One Direction or anything like that or the Butts guys. I'm talking about being passionate in art, singing, Rubik's cubing, basketball, soccer. Hey, actually, technically, demographically, geographically, mathematically, mechanically, and statistically, it's called football. Oh, um, my bad. Anyway, football, ping pong, horseback riding, etc. Being passionate in something like that is very attractive because it just shows that you're your own person and maybe you're good at it, you work hard at it. I think it's just cool. I know a girl's more attractive if she's like really into something. Maybe if she's really good at volleyball or something. I know she'll be playing volleyball. Girls who do nothing are usually pretty clingy. You gotta text them 24 seven. Same with dudes too. So yeah, I think when you do something, it's just more attractive, I don't know. But that's a big thing to make girls like you. Be passionate, work hard on something, be good at something and have a talent. Another thing is I wear the color red. I feel like red is a very spicy and crispy color with a bit of saucy and a hint of frisky. It's just got flair and it's a color that shows confidence which girls like. I was doing some research and I found an article that suggests that women like men who can tell stories. There's no real evidence on why this is but men that tell stories put themselves on a higher status and women naturally like men of higher status. When I read this article, I realized, you know what I do a lot on my channel? Tell stories. There you have it, folks. So the next thing is, I think the biggest thing that gets me the ladies, eye contact. I got that juicy eye contact. So if you ever catch a girl looking at you in class or something, don't look away, stay confident. Keep staring at her to the point where it's awkward, but she's so stunned by your juicy eye contact so she can't look away. Be a Medusa and seduce her. Mm. So stare till it gets a bit unnatural, and then you hold the stare for a second, blink very slowly while casually looking back down at your paper. Ladies cannot resist that. Trust me, I know my facts. So some of you may be thinking, I mean, I can use these tips, but I'm still gonna look like Roz from Monster Z so what do I do about that? Well, here's what you do. Don't care about your looks. If you're comfortable with your appearance, other people will too. Just don't be insecure, especially as a guy. As a guy, never be insecure, all right? It doesn't really matter if a girl's insecure because the guy will just keep complimenting her. It's like, I think my chesticles are really small. No, you can show me. I think they're amazing. It doesn't matter if a girl's insecure, but if a dude's insecure, it don't work like that. <sighs> I have a little pump. Uh, okay, bye. If you're gonna be insecure, keep it inside, but as guys, we gotta show confidence! Confidence is the best replacement for anything, alright? Same with girls too, if you actually are insecure, like, if you're confident, it makes that unattractiveness go away. Just have good hygiene, take a shower, brush your corn kernel looking teeth, and you'll be fine. Don't care about what others think. Here's an example. Do you know that fat chick that's in every popular group and you're just like, why is she with them? Why is she popular? How does she just get a prom date? What the fuck? Well, the answer is, she doesn't give a fuck. She doesn't care that she's fat. She's gonna get popular and get boys and being fat ain't gonna stop her. Be that fat girl but this is why i think the ladies like me you know what's crazy about this video though i wrote this whole script when i was 16 i just found this on google docs and i thought it was pretty funny and i've been through a lot since then i learned a lot of things so expect a new video like this soon i'm gonna lay a whole game plan out for my fellas all right so thank you guys for watching make sure to like and subscribe and click the little ding dong to know when i upload um uh And... Shall we?